Today I am going to the Singapore Zoo. I've heard that it is a fantastic place, um, a really good zoo, so I'm really looking forward to checking it out and getting to see all kinds of sweet, sweet animals. There's no time! Thanks. Stealthy birds! Fluffy something. Bee's worst nightmare. Flat snake with legs. I'm not sure what kind of zoo this is. Um, I was kind of expecting like normal animals, but it turns out that I've wandered into Jurassic Park. <laughs> Lumbering stone animals. Hmm, what's going on over here? That's disgusting! Mini lumbering stone animals. A spotted tongue flicker. of primates. Primates are divided into four main groups. Drosnians, monkeys, apes, humans. No! Brown capuchin. Hairy tree frog. Chimpanzees. Australian tree hopper. Australian boinger. Piglet's hairy uncle. A mini wide mouthed pond dweller. Glass chompers. Striped ghost cat. Hair combing bug eaters. I only have a minute left before the elephant show. Ah! Alright then, let's go. Just made it.
Elefantes. And time to go. Rhinoceroses. A spotted sprinter. Zebras. Spotted Brachiosaurus. A roaring main cat. The larval rhinoceros. Gigantic leafy bug. Mighty water pancakes. The world's miniest deer. Dracula. Salah. Small happy jumpers. Speed run complete. Checking out the monkeys, and it's so cool how close we are to them. Like, just open, I'm on the sidewalk, a little bit of river, and then the monkeys are living right over there. It's so cool. Look how cool this is. Look how close we are. Our walkway and just so open and feels like you're so up close and personal with the animals. White tigers are so cool. Look how cool these plants are. It's like pew, 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 pew. super neat. Man, I've never seen anything like it. We have giraffe feeding here and this is where you feed them from. I mean, this is like not even that tall. I assume that they walk right up to you, I don't know, I missed the feeding by like 20 minutes. But anyways, that's incredible. Alright, so check it out, the rainforest experience, you get to go through a set of doors, and then there's like drapery chains, so you get to go get through those. And then another set of doors that says don't keep the doors open because the butterflies might escape. And this is pretty cool. This is like a little canopied area that they have a bunch of different kinds of birds and like small mammals and butterflies and stuff that you can just kind of walk around and see them. It's so cool being this close though. And you got me, a little tiny bit of vegetation and a small fence. It's unbelievable. So these super intimate encounters that we have where we're standing right here and wild animals are right there. I've started to notice that they string up electric wire. So I don't know if you can see. See that electric wire all in there? I have it like built into these walls as well. Electric wire, um, and like on this river here too. So that's how they keep it so that we can be so close, but the animals don't climb out of their cages because they don't really want to get electrocuted.